Angel X All-in-One Enigma. I'm gonna put it on a yellow pad and I'm gonna put it on the super machine here. And let's see how that works. Stay tuned. All right guys, let me give you a little backstory here. I was cleaning the car and I noticed some water etching marks or some type of chemical etching marks. Something may have kicked up from the road or it could just be water, I don't know. Uh, never really have this problem and it's on the top front corner of the roof. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, wet sand with 2000 and then 3000 grit and see how much better I can get these. I'm sure I can go pretty deep with them because they seem pretty deep. So I don't think they're going to come out totally to my satisfaction, but if I can just smooth them out enough, that's fine for me. I will be using the Adams Swirl Killer Micro Polisher and Angel X Enigma all in one for this and a yellow pad. I have been trying earlier just to polish it out and it wouldn't come out. I used different compounds and things and it, it didn't do anything to it so I went with the wet sanding. At this point I'm just trying to find all the little spots. I'm looking it over real hard. It's a pain in the ass and uh, you have to get them just at the right angle to see them so Little by little, I'll get there. Now I'm gonna go ahead and switch up to the 3000 grit and uh, go over the whole area. Just try to even it out. And then from there, we'll use the Adams Swirl Killer and the Angel X. So here's the light. I've been wet sanding little parts of this off and on here and there. So this is what it looks like right now. As you get over here, see I haven't touched it. The paint's good over here, just to let you understand. But once I start coming back, I've been trying to get these little spots out. So they've been a pain in the ass. So anyway, so normally I'd get a big polish and knock it out real quick, but I want to try to do it with some angel wax and Adam's SK Swirl Killer Micro. go so we still have some spots some lots of scratches but that was real fast and that was with the micro so as I get away from it here's what it should look like can you see that is that crazy and then when you get over here and that's what it's cleaned up already so does this thing correct Absolutely. Boom. Is it finished? No, but I just want to show you. Yeah, it's cutting away 2,000 and 3,000 grits. Boom. All right.
All right, now let's take a look here. Ooh, getting a lot better. Look at that, not too bad. A couple little here, little spots there. But what does it really look like? That's what it should be. Yuck. 2,000, 3,000, bang. Angel wax, all in one. And the Adams, non-powerful, as they say, swirl killer. Once again, bam. And then we come back to here. See, these are the little things I wanted to get out. Can you see those? Looks like I'm gonna have to go over that again. So in the end, as I got more ground to cover, and I want to get it done faster, and that little one is not made to do this big of work, I'm just going to use the SPCA. Right here, I brought out the tax systems oil zero. Just want to get a better look at what I was doing and cleaned up the paint so I could get in close. Let's take a look. So I'm done. Let's see. Uh, this is the Adams swirl killer portion. 2000 grit was as low as I went. And then I picked up the SPTA three inch because I just had a lot more room to go and uh, I need to get it done. Put this around. But that is with Angel Wax all in one Enigma. Oh, there's a couple of those. Okay, I'll live with them. They're a little too deep. I don't want to keep going. I'm just happy to get them cut down a little bit. You can't really see them without that light. So that's using the Chinese made SPTA. That's an awesome machine. I think it's around $60. I don't know. It's not that expensive. And I'm sure that's Chinese made as well. For those that think they make shitty machines, these two machines work fantastic. Fantastic. And you know how we do it. That Enigma all in one from Angel Wax. That's the good good.